Good morning, everyone. I'll make a brief statement. I will not be taking questions at this time. The United Nations, along with several intergovernmental and non-governmental organizations, is currently monitoring a potential humanitarian and environmental emergency taking place on Mount Kalud on the island of Java, the Ngozi Crater in Tanzania, and the Huayanapatina volcano in Peru. In the last couple of days, scientists have alerted us to the increasing possibility of simultaneous eruptions in those regions. The aftermath of such eruptions would have a profoundly disruptive effect on human settlements in the areas, as well as the potential to disrupt agricultural production, air transportation, energy production, and distribution areas far beyond those directly affected. Now currently, the International Fund for Agricultural Development, the Food and Agricultural Organization of the United Nations, the United Nations World Food Program, along with the UN's Environment Program and the World Meteorological Organization, are evaluating the impact of such an event based on projected models and what the effect would be on climate and food production in the areas directly affected as well as around the globe. The International Civil Aviation Organization is also coordinating with local and international authorities the necessary steps to be taken should a disruption of civil aviation arise from the eruption and subsequent ash debris. A meeting of the Security Council has been convened to discuss all possible actions to be taken in aiding those countries directly facing the environmental threat, as well as the necessary steps to safeguard food supplies and peace in the regions. To that effect, the United Nations Department of Peacekeeping Operations, along with the Office of the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, is monitoring all potential civil unrest as well as any humanitarian needs that might require any urgent force mobilization in order to maintain peace and order. Now we urge all those directly affected by the eruptions to remain calm and to accept and follow all and any instructions you may receive from local civil authorities. The next official announcement will be made as soon as we have some relevant information. Thank you.